But because it disrupts the neurotransmitters in the brain, it causes some damage in the DNA. So you can have a couple, both having a couple of cups of coffee a day, maybe a Coke. What do you have here? Uh, Dr. Pepper, maybe chocolate. If this is happening day after day after day, then that couple will conceive and have a child and that child can have a tendency to autism, uh, attention deficit syndrome, because they've been born with a gene that has disrupted the uh, neurotransmitters in the brain. And they don't tell you that on the coffee packet, do they?